We work very well together. We set up an incident command right at the state line, so we were all talking to each other. We all knew what each other were doing. Several police agencies in Pennsylvania and Ohio come together to track down a suspect on the run. We're learning new information at noon about a police chase and a massive manhunt from early this morning in Mercer County. One man is now in custody after the search lasted all through the night. 27 First News reporter Dan Marcel has the newest details. 27-year-old Gabriel Queener of Youngstown was arrested at 2 a.m. Monday morning. He was at the center of an hours-long manhunt from law enforcement in Pennsylvania and Ohio. He attempted to initiate a traffic stop and the vehicle uh, sped away. The information we had, of course, is that he was possibly armed and dangerous, so we certainly don't want to take that lightly. Around 7.45 Sunday evening, Hermitage police noticed Queener and another person in a vehicle and saw suspected narcotic activity. When the officer attempted to pull him over, Queener and his passenger fled to Shenango Township, where he lost control of his Ford Taurus on Route 318. Suspect crashed into another vehicle, just still inside Pennsylvania, but right at the state line. They immediately fled on foot. Several law enforcement departments from Ohio and PA then conducted a massive search. Canine units were called, as well as the Pennsylvania State Police helicopter. Queener eventually surrendered after he was found inside a WRTA bus in the parking lot on Hubbard Majory Road. Uh, we're following some tracks. Uh, we've been searching for hours, and they did eventually find the suspect right here in, uh, inside this bus. Queener admitted he fled from police because he didn't have a driver's license. He also thought there was a warrant out for his arrest and was smoking marijuana before he was pulled over. Queener's passenger claims not to know him. Queener is facing several charges, including DUI, fleeing and eluding police, and reckless driving. The two other people involved in the crash are listed in stable condition. Dan Marcel, 27 First News.